Hmm, looks like it's snowing in single player, but it's just not sticking. Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. Yeah, I don't know. I'm guessing we may as well. If we're gonna, if we're gonna have an arcade up here. Let's see. There's nothing in the. There's nothing in the awards chest yet. So that's this will make for a good, uh, a good opportunity, just to see. See how did how well did he clean the bathrooms? All right, that's wow. A lot of stainless going on here. Okay, that's pretty upscale. I don't think there's much in the uh, the old safe here just yet. A little some. Four grand. We need to we need to up our game, as it were. We got twelve and a half million in the bank here. We might as well. Do a couple of uh, couple upgrades. Let's see how we go back. Wizards run we got. Own don't don't. I wonder how they determine the uh, the prices on these things. We're gonna we're gonna fully upgrade. That's everything. Upgrade. Welcome to the Lester tab. <laughs> or the Lester and Page tab, if I'm going to give her her due. So, you want a drone base to launch all out attacks on the normies? We got one. You want to run all your business interests spread out around the state from the convenience of one gaming chair? We got an MCT, Master Control Terminal, for that too. Even works for supply and purchase runs on the open road, whatever that is. <clears throat> Little JT would be proud. <laughs> you know, I think I'm gonna wait until maybe, maybe someday these things come on sale. Cause that those are some really big purchases. Yeah, someday they'll be, maybe they'll have free arcade games. Oh, we've missed out on that, but you know we're making money in the meantime. And the main thing. <clears throat> is to, uh, let's go Nick slot. Oh, they haven't been delivered yet. Okay, we have to wait for the games to be delivered. The main thing is, let's get this arcade looking cool like an arcade should. My thoughts a little since we last went over this. We got three boards. This one covers scoping. And the intel we need to gather on casino security and what they're keeping in the vault. Vault contents. We need to know what they're keeping down there. Hack into their internal security feed to see inside. Are you a nerd about this stuff or do you like winging it? If you want to practice for this test, we can get a copy of their door security locks made and installed down here so you can practice on them. And a model of the casino might come in handy for planning, too. Okay, so installed where? Because, I mean, I, nev I never did find that in my other... My other setup. We did, I did that and I never was able to practice. Of course, we never really used hacking in that first heist. We just had all the key cards. Hmm. I think, I think we're done scoping. We've scoped it all pretty well. Okay, we might as well do the whole contents check here. Okay, here we go. Let's find out what's in that vault. First, we need someone with the right login credentials for their security system. 
I tracked the rough location of a member of Duggan's security team using his phone signal. Head over there and find him. Go to Vespucci. Alright, I think we could probably go to a helicopter here for this. We could just enjoy a nice long drive. <coughs> In the snow. The snow is so special, but... Howdy, Brad. Hi. Yeah, there is life, you know. It's gonna take forever with this. I'm a little melancholy about the soon to be absence of snow and Christmassy things. Which, you know, is one of the reasons why normally when I would do a time warp again, like just flying from one point to another. Just gonna soak up the look of not chilly out in the snow. It's just so much snow. Come to think of it. Oh man, I'll have to have to check that. That should be one more snow fred. Over on the Brookie Channel. Hmm. Not gonna be able to log in live on that one. Having dinner over at my sister's today, which should be awesome. It's going to be so awesome. I have been extremely blessed in the fact that I come from a family of good cooks and then of course was blessed enough to be able to marry a wonderful cook. So I'm just surrounded by good food all the time. It's just life is good. Really and truly, if you have food, life is good. I mean, that's something to be thankful for. And if you don't, hang in there. God still has a plan for you to get you to where you need to be. Now, there's your deep philosophy with the Black Knight uh, today. Let's go. Mac up an NPC here, and that'll be the thing. Over in Vespucci. I got him down to Vespucci. Okay. Chopper commandoing in here. No one noticed this here, you know, helicopter coming in. Well, someone's got a, a nice car. That the guy? No? Can we jack this? Since when can you jack a, uh, a ranchero? Since when do these spawn? Out of this urge area. There he is. I've uploaded a Securo Serve app for you to hack his phone and get those login details. Thing works well, but you'll need to stick close to get the data. Shit, he's on to you. Try and complete the hack if you can. Otherwise, you might need to put him down. Come on, we need the app. What do you mean no invites? Some is glitched out here. Why can't I get to the app?
Well, this is awkward. I just take out. I don't. I, it's not giving me the opportunity to uh, to do anything but run him over. Let's get back to my helicopter. That's an interesting something glitched out there where it, I should be able to hack the guy as opposed to just having to run him over. I don't even know why he'd be on to me. I just kind of showed up. Maybe this is his truck. So there's your tip of the day. Don't take the guy's truck and then run him over. Oh, GTA. The immoral things they make you do for money. Go to the casino see what's inside. Oh, to make a lot of monies. Beautiful snow, Christmas time. I know, it seems odd to be going on about Christmas time when I just ran a guy over for his pass. There's a whole philosophical thought for you. Are, are the things you do in-game, things that you're, you're morally held accountable for in, in the long run? <clears throat> I would think we... Bring out your phone and search for a Wi-Fi signal we can piggyback on. And try not to look too conspicuous while you do it. The inside track features the top... Now I think what you do is so to NPCs and computer stuff. Come no. enjoy the thrill of horse racing. New races every few minutes. I wonder if you're if you're if you're completely you know torturing somebody. In game, when they're just trying to sell stuff, and you're making them actually miserable. But I'm almost there. Where the heck? Okay, just press E, alright. You only have a limited amount of time in the security feed, so move fast. Find what's in that vault and sniff around for whatever else they have tucked away down there. You might find something we can use to our advantage. And you basically just have to quickly pan through everything here, that's... Doo -doo -doo. As soon as you see point of interest scoped, yeah, it looks like we're we're good there. There might be multiple points of interest in that room. Point of interest scoped. Point of interest scoped. Point of interest, point of interest. Looks like it's going to be a cash run. Ah, what's that look like? The green stuff, huh? Yeah, it's too much currency, so we'll still need to launder it through a buyer. Shouldn't be hard, though. Head back to the arcade when you're ready. Points of interest, we're looking for them points. Points of interest, we're looking for the points. See, so many points of interest scoped.
Yeah, now we're done. We can exit. Leave the casino. Not a problem. I don't have a good feeling I'm going to win that one just yet. I should have till, you know, Wednesday. I should have a few more spins. I'm probably going to hold off on getting my master control terminal until until I have either won the won that Comet Safari here. Because I'm going to change my um, I think we'll do that shortly. Change my um, spawn point back to the casino. Just so I can keep doing the wheel spins. You know, that's wheel spins are a thing. Get a phone call. Because eventually I will just stick this character up in the arcade on the other end of the map. Use the master control terminal just to keep my bunker loaded. And what I might just do is play video games. Play video games inside a video game. Oh yeah, I was saying. Like if you're if you're a griefer, and then let's say you know piano falls on you, do you have to answer for the time you you made some 15 year old kid cry? I mean, you are just being cruel for the, for the sake of cruelty. And it is against another person. I mean, that's... I think there's some, some iffy, uh, iffy territory there. You can say, well, that was the expectation of the game. You were playing the game. I guess it's the same kind of thing where if you... If you're playing NFL football and you break somebody's legs with a low shot, well, that's just the game. Do you have to answer for anything? I don't know. If you're playing basketball and you just whip the ball at the guy's face and just knock him right the heck out and then you go up for two. Is that, you know... Alright, that probably would constitute a foul. This is not going well. Come on, we're almost home. Right, I think we're going to be walking. Come on. These buzzards, they're just, they're just not reliable vehicles. Come on. That's it. But, we're only a block and a half away, so... Hey, Hello, Mr. Hey, girl. Nice bullet. I don't know why they made the bullet such a poor performer. Let's go take a look at the board. Book your party at Pixel Pete's. Where their pizza just can't be beat. Oh, that's why the place closed, you know? It's Target cash. Okay, now that we know what we're stealing, it's time to choose how to steal it. We got three approaches. Each deals with security in a different way. Let's take a look. Silent and sneaky. Now, I'm not meant to have favorites, but... <laughs> if you've ever seen me creeping into your bedroom and videoing you in your sleep, you'll know this one's for me. Ah! You gotta get in and out without being seen, avoiding work dealing with the guards. The big con, it's catfishing IRL. <laughs> and who doesn't like pretending there's someone else and making a mark look stupid? In this case, we're fooling casino security. 
get a hold of some uniforms, and walk in there like you know what you're doing. Aggressive! Grr! <laughs> this approach relies on going in hard and fast and violent and catching security on the back foot. Expect heavy resistance by the time you make your way out. Price of doing it dirty, I guess. Okay, well, what's this last little thing there, the pin with the cards and the... Let's see, extras. I guess we don't really need the casino model. Because we've already seen the casino model and we, we did all that. That's what you're going to get from the casino model. The door security. I can practice at my other facility if I really want to. I can figure it out because I already paid for that. So let's all let go. It's a con yeah. job. Hey, you don't exactly have the gift of the gab, but you might have the ego to pull this off. I keep thinking back to that incident you witnessed on the casino roof. If we use that guy to get in, oh boy, that'd be some story. Yeah. Now the crew. We need them here at Mission Control, organizing everything with me. Gunmen! These guys will use their contacts to source some unmarked weapons. And if you've got the spare cash, it'll also help reduce the heat by causing a distraction during the getaway. The driver! They're gonna set up your getaway vehicle and a switcher card to help you lose the cops if you want to pay for one of those. Better the driver, better the cars they can help you acquire. Hackers! My tribe. <laughs> They'll determine how long you get in the vault, so choose wisely or, you know, cheaply. Your call. Okay. For the hackers. We need to unlock that other hacker at some point. Paige is just completely rude to you. Five percent. Johan's. Johan's. I think one of my uh, techs from the nightclub. But time in the vault is a critical thing. Yep, she terrifies me, but he's the best of the bunch. Now, what this falls under the heading of is what vehicles do we want to unlock? Okay, that will get us. Some medium level kind of stuff. See, now that's like the, the best fast vehicles. Good. Motorcycles are good. I don't think that unlocks anything. I'm all about to unlock. the unlock. Now the Zaba... Maybe what we'll do is we'll save the Zaba for when we actually do redo this with Young Ancestor. Or do we have to rescope it with... Maybe we should do it with, you know, I do not want to do the Young Ancestor thing again particularly. Do we want to unlock a Zaba for this character? I... Let's go. Eddie the tow truck! <laughs> Gonna be in good hands with Eddie here. And let's go good guns. Although, tell you what, that bullpup shotgun might be good enough. We're in close for the most part. I'll give us an extra 2%. Eh. Oh, I didn't know there was a, you could go all the way up to expert here. I think I used I think I used Gustav on my first run through with these weapons. Should we go the full ten percent? That'd be like a hundred grand. We'd. Oh, maybe you get Chester McCoy if you're not using him as the driver, because I use Chester, I think, as the driver to get the Zabas. This guy, Chester? Cool. Great. As long as he doesn't snap, we'll be dandy. Well, then. Sultan Classic. All right, the Sultan Classic seems like it's a good thing to try and get. 
Put away those shark cards. We need to steal decent getaway vehicles that are in no way associated with our bank accounts. Your driver will help. Let's do it. In the snow. Let's go get your getaway vehicles, huh? They're perfect. Untraceable. They're not even legally in the U.S. Some illicit importers are bringing them through L.S. Little Bighorn Avenue. Wow. See, you can see the real, the real downside of this location. I am out of the way. Oh, come now. That's a back off the helicopter. Doof. This is why this location is free. But on the plus side, we will get a full drive through the entire length of Los Santos in the snow. And a scenic daytime trip down. See, it's all about the snow. Yeah, that's a little title of the video. Casino crap. But it's all about the snow. Look at this. I so wish you could just turn this on. You know, set up a, you know, select a, uh, a session with snow. All year round. They can make the setting Ice Age. I mean, it's not like they put everybody in one session anyway. You should be able to do that. Find a session or create a session in snow. And let people join who want to join snow sessions. If nobody wants to do that and you got a solo session, well, hey, that's even better. I would have that set all the time. It would just be always smooth. Yeah, I guess maybe when summer rolls around, I might actually turn it off. But eh, like in, in, in real life. Go to Little Big Horn Avenue with your helicopter. I still don't know why that guard would have cared if I was just standing around him. Unless that was his truck. Looks like these smugglers have already started to unload the containers. Makes the logistics somewhat easier, but be ready for some fighting. Well then, didn't get to missile them as much as I thought. Well, luckily I don't need the helicopter. Equally lucky, I have some weapons at my disposal. All you have to do is play the make them all fall down game, you know, I really need to snack this up. Lasers! Make them all fall down. 
in the face. Still lots of them. I don't have really good cover apparently, but I'm getting shot to hit. Can't use that near the cars naturally. Or myself. That should have saved us a little bit of time. Wrong gun, wrong gun. Oh, we have to drive both of them all the way back up. This is gonna, this is really gonna make me pay I mean, for using the cheap, the cheap and sleazy uh, option for... Here we are, slipping and sliding through the snow in the Sultan Classic. It has a nice sound to it. Nice engine sound. Hey, I can't say hey Vince, I don't know. Really nice. Interesting. Six more miles to go, wow. This in for my younger son wakes up. Gonna send him away. It feels like it, it, it lacks a little bit of top end. Now that may be because we haven't done the upgrades yet. Upgrades are gonna be a thing. But I don't know, I don't feel like this is a, a top-end kind of car. I guess you shouldn't expect it to have a higher top speed than a regular Sultan, right? Good look at this. Well, it should be the Subaru, but I'm getting kind of an Evo vibe. Right well, that guy certainly did. I mean, there is a, there is a certain Sub feel to it, too, but I don't know. I, why am I getting an Evo vibe? Right This is going to be really annoying for a game of the fourth match. But again, it is in the snow. The beautiful snow. Hmm. It's going to be interesting. When this car eventually becomes available, how it, how it stacks up against the other, the other cars in its class. I can't get a real feel for it in the snow. It's the really turbo grippy. It feels grippy. But again, I don't feel, I feel like it's running out of breath. It's just the, the top end of it. Maybe again, we just need to get that turbo on. <sighs> we 
You delivered high K Prime, but we need to go get the other one. <clears throat> and for that, we need a Helio Chopter. A Whirly Bird. A, uh, a thing with the spinners that makes it go spinny. Let's, let's fly through the air with the greatest of ease. And watch the, the doof drive right away. No? What? You for real? I don't fucking believe this! Now, will there be any bad guy? Would have been so so much shorter a video if it wasn't for the snow. The pixels of the snow. It's all just a bunch of white pixels instead of green pixels. Why does it matter? And it's they're slippery pixels, of course. It's what those pixels represent, I guess. California snow. I know, I'm just kind of just quietly, uh, don't, I don't even have any commentary, I'm just like, just happily zipping along. Visibility is a little bit down now. Let's snack it up a little bit more. Next. Keeping, 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 keeping. Over to here. Don't really want to use missiles because anybody who's left is going to be really next to the bar. Right? Oh, that's those are that's a vehicle. He's not next to the bar. And he's not next to the bar. That guy's close to the car, but not close enough. He's not near the car. There's a cargo bob. I guess in case I just want to carry the thing back, but that's a thought. That would be, but you know, trying to pick that thing up, park where it is. This doesn't have to be parked where it is, does it? All right, this could end badly. Why? Let's put this someplace relatively clear. Considering I got the free location, this might be worth it. Okay, 
the target clear enough from the poles. Everything else patient. Being patient. Yeah. So. So this is a long car. I hooked the wrong car, they're going for a ride. Oh, so frustrating to try and he won't even just he touched it but it didn't didn't oh, it down no. right. You have to just perfectly teabag the thing and it's just such a pain in the bum. Am I even saving time? You got it. Straight up. Give me lots of height. We're gonna need lots of height. Boku amounts of height. Okay. That should be enough to get us over the mountain. Or at least around the mountain. We'll go through the gap here, we won't go directly. Now this may not feel fast. But believe it or not, when this helicopter gets moving, it is a very fast way to get across the map. Now, I wouldn't want to do this, you know, in a public session. You'd just be done. We have to make sure that we're really close to the ground when we drop this off there. You don't want to blow up the car. And maybe sets them to be, you know, relatively indestructible too. We don't know. Don't crash into the ground. Basically, that was definitely quicker. At least that's how it felt. Oh, wait a minute. I thought now we have to cross the darn the lake and things like that. I thought we were so close. Oop! Okay, that didn't, that didn't go well. And I'll be perfectly honest, I do not want to cross the river with this smoking light. In the way. Well, should we try it? This could end so badly. I'm crossing a lake with a smoking helicopter. Get me to the dirt, get me to the dirt, get me to the dirt, get me to the dirt. Oh, this isn't the populated part of the dirt. Okay, there's roads. Here. Oh, that was... It was hilarious, but, you know. Come on, get up. Up Simba. You do not want to have to test the off-road capabilities. Alright, this is looking like a theme. It's coming in on fumes, getting back to pick your beef. Okay, this is 
lower it down. No, 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 no. Eject! That does not smooth. Did it land upper? Yes, it did. Beat the heck, but it did land up. All right, that added an element of danger, but... <sighs> but we got him. Now those are the two. And then they, they throw this extra car in there. I'm not sure... Is that like the driver's car? Somebody's car. Not my car. Hmm. Don't know if I want to do more for this video. That would be... That, that's been enough, I think, for right now. Enough snow. It was all about the snow. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen... We'll, we'll do more of these as things go on, as time, as time goes on. Uh, you know what we should do, though? Let's head upstairs and, and position all of our arcade things. Make sure that we're rocking the full 50k here. The fastest money. Oh, that's not the, we have to, oh, sorry, we have to do it from the the menu. We have to stand up. Stand up. Give us the menu. The arcade thingy menu. Arcade management. Okay, next slot, next slot, next slot, next slot, next slot, next slot, next slot. Defender of the Faith. Monkey's Paradise. Put a penetrator machine in. Another Madame Nazar. Why is it not? It's a lot. Space Monkey 3. And the Wizard Room. We'll go heavy on the Wizard Room. Oh, look, we got even more stuff. Do another Street Crimes. Just bang. Space Monkey 3 has a good look to it. You know, it's... Oh, wait, that's previous, previous, previous slot. Defender of the Faith. Mm, next slot. Monkey Paradise. That's good. You only really, you don't need that much of Madame Nazar, you know? So another Defender of the Faith. Another monkey paradise. Should we swap that out into a... Oh, there you go. A shiny wasabi kitty claw. I didn't see a love professor. Do we have... The love professor. Did that... Did we have one before? Is there a, is there a nun now? No, it doesn't look like it. I wonder why only one of that can be can be present. Is the same thing, yeah, with the wasabi. Okay. So now if I'm right, 
we should now have the the golden award here in our award tip tip there it is that must be the golden the golden or you have all the arcade games you get the golden arcade thing Think it's ever possible to win one? Okay. I'll try just moving directly left. More cliche. I have more bag cliches. You never get anything. That's. <laughs> How do you play this? Waiting for the other player. Oh goodness, you have to you have to grab the other Don't forget your homework. You have to wait for the other turns if it tells you if you're in love with each other. That's messed up. How are we on that messed up note? There'll be will be other there'll be other episodes where I play a lot of video games, but at least the arcade is good to go for right now. Like I said, I'll probably hold off until I'm no longer using this guy for wheel spins. I'm spinning with my other character. Spawn location. And once this guy's living at the arcade, then we'll get the master control terminal so I can just keep feeding the bunker business and anything else that goes on. But at that, on that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night. And a happy new year. And happy Epiphany. Merry Christmas. Enjoy the snow. For as long as it lasts.